What comes to mind when you think of Bali? Acres of lush tropical rainforest? A land of pure natural beauty with untouched beaches stretching out for miles? What about cultural haven rich in traditions and spirituality? These are some of the endless treasures that need protecting. What is the current reality? What has rapid development and tourism without the necessary infrastructure done to the island of the Buds? So it speaks volumes today as we stand here, grateful for these mountains of trash, but why? In Bali, around 65,000 tonnes of trash doesn't make it to landfill every day. Instead, it fills the oceans, lines the beaches, and disrupts the true essence of Bali. But of course, landfill isn't the solution, but it's a lot better than the alternative. Indonesia is the second greatest contributor to ocean plastic, responsible for dumping an estimated 3.2 million tonnes a year. That's 90 tonnes every single minute. Where is this plastic coming from? It comes from people making seemingly small decisions every day, buying bottles of water, not refusing the straw, accepting plastic bags, and buying food in unnecessary plastic packaging. So what are the options for disposal? Approximately half of Indonesia doesn't have access to waste disposal. An effective rubbish collection system is pretty much non-existent. So what is half of the country supposed to do with building piles of trash? They have two main options. One, burning it into toxic fumes which cause health issues. Or two, throwing it out of sight into the river, bound for the ocean. So what now? What do we think the number one solution is? The most effective method is to just stop. Stop using plastic and start using the alternatives. Yes, it's all well and good finding ways to deal with the plastic that we produce, but ultimately we need to stop it at the source. So how did we become inspired to go plastic free? We got involved with beach cleanups and through seeing the amount of trash firsthand, it inspired us to change our lifestyle. So beach cleanups, they drive awareness and they empower a community to recognise that when united, they can be a part of something a lot bigger than themselves. Not only is it inspiring for the individuals, but it starts a conversation and spreads awareness. We all need to accept our responsibility and recognise our power to be catalysts for change. Be the hero of your story, your children's story, and be the difference you want to see in the world. Impossible is just an opinion.